pretty nice in most of the Miami Valley. Some of our northern or western counties have a few showers already, but that's not going to be the steady rain. So that's going to come through and be done. We'll wait until later today to get that steadier rain going. Here's a look at your forecast over the next several hours. We'll be right around 55 degrees at 8 o'clock, still cloudy, and 10 o'clock, 57. Again, we couldn't rule out a passing shower through the morning, but the better chance comes as we head into our afternoon. South wind today between 10 and 20 miles per hour. It's going to be a little bit breezy. And if we're heading down to Clifton Mills for the lighting as we go through this evening, unfortunately, it looks kind of wet with the chance for some showers. And this may be one of the last places that sees rain in the Miami Valley, uh, but it's going to be increasing those rain chances as we go into the evening hours. So be aware of that. At least it won't be too cold. It'll be nice and cool. Here's live Doppler 2 HD, all glaze county now into western Shelby County, extending back through Dark County. We have those showers, initially scattered activity, but again, this is going to fill in and become area-wide as we go through the afternoon. You can see back to the west, we're really just getting the tip of the iceberg here with a few showers. The bulk of the rain is back across Illinois, western Indiana, and down into Missouri. It's just this conveyor belt of moisture riding up along a frontal boundary, and this cold front comes through and brings in some colder weather for the upcoming weekend. Right now, it's 56 degrees. We've got a south wind at 21, so it is a breezy start already, and that's going to be the case through the afternoon. Everyone's generally in the mid-50s now. We have 55 in Greenville, Wapakoneta, 56 in Urbana, and then 54 in Xenia. Here's future track with the best chance of rain this morning, again, in the northern or western counties. As we head towards lunchtime, we're really not going to see much easterly progression of that rain. So still, northern or western counties around noon will be the best shot at rain. The rest of us still pretty quiet. But as we head beyond 1, 2, 3 o'clock, the rain chances will be going up. Here's 5 o'clock. You can see a good part of the Miami Valley dealing with wet conditions. The exception may be portions of Green and Clinton counties. That far southeastern Miami Valley, the rain is going to take a little bit longer to get there, but by evening, we're looking at wet weather there as well. The rain's going to continue through the overnight hours, even into Saturday morning, and unfortunately, it looks like a wet Saturday afternoon as well. But there's the best chance to see a little more dry time across the northern counties with more rain, likely for the southern half of the valley tomorrow. Today will still be mild, up near 60, breezy with afternoon rain becoming more and more likely. And tonight we drop down to 42 with rain likely area wide. Tomorrow is going to be a good chance of some showers. It will be cloudy and cooler with a high of only 45 degrees. Your Storm Team 2 seven day forecast. On Sunday, there's a little bit less of a rain chance. We're still going to have the threat of a few showers, especially in the southern half of the Miami Valley. But then the rain chance goes up early next week, both Monday and Tuesday. We have a decent shot. And then temperatures will actually turn a little chilly behind Tuesday's cold front. We'll drop into the low 40s for highs Wednesday and Thursday.